Welcome everyone to our sixth annual art festival here on Sunny Revere Beach. Um, we have close to 30 art vendors here gracing us up here on the bridge and on the um, boulevard. Lots of variety of artists, some great artwork. We have a live art competition going on for a couple of hours, so we're anxious to see what um, creations they'll have for us. Um, we'd like to thank all of our sponsors who kindly help us put on an event like this uh, and all of the people who are enjoying us here on the beach. So thanks again, enjoy and um, see you next year. My name is Tori Chaffee. My name is Genevieve Jaleo. We are in a band called New Waves. We have an Instagram uh, mention at New Waves Duo. Uh, we play a lot in Revere. We're playing right now at the Revere, um, Revere Beach Art Festival. We're playing next week, um, September 22nd, at the Revere Beach Pop-Up, where Pete Superbeef used to be. And we play Bianchi's a lot. We're playing Bianchi's on the 29th next Friday. Yeah, we play there about once a month. Um, yeah, we play all over. Check us out. Yeah, yeah appreciate it. Hello, <laughs> uh, my name is Naomi. Uh, I run a little shop called Nomiomi on Etsy, and I also have Instagram it's called Nomiomi, Nomi underscore Omi. I have various wares over here. I have little baby stickers. I got little cat stickers. What more could you want out of life? I got one dressed as a cowboy for if that's your thing. I got one with an apple on his head if that's your thing. I got little keychains. I got little prints. I have this really scary drawing of Kirby, if that's your thing. Um, <laughs> uh, I like drawing little guys. And this is my mom's stuff. My mom likes making little guys. And she takes pictures and she makes little things. We also have, whoa, we got earrings. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Good afternoon. My name is Cheryl Woodbury. I do live in Revere. This is my first year at the uh, fair festival today. Um, I do painting and mixed media, and would love to see you come down. Uh, hello, I'm Warren. Uh, I've been doing art for a long time, really, honestly, since I was young. But uh, I've never uh, like um, took it serious or like a job or anything like that. Uh, it's been about a couple weeks. I've been doing that and. I'm here now. I usually just uh, use acrylics. I used to do oil. Um, I do like pop culture, a lot of music stuff, a lot of everything. Honestly, I do anything. But hey, I thought, why not come at least show some stuff, even if like it, I wasn't like really out here to sell stuff. It'd still be nice to show stuff. What do we call it? It's the frozen in time jewelry here. What we're gonna do is like say you have a memorabilia or anything that you want to like remember somebody by and there's an event that happens in your life, you can take a piece from that event and have it frozen in the jewelry and wear it around so it's unique. You're not, you know, comparing yourself to anyone with Louis Vuitton or this and that. This is personal to you. You know, so I think you should take a look at it. Great product. Local. Two local girls on the company. Um, we've been doing this about three years and like you said it's um, jewelry made from flowers and our main focus is we take flowers that customers give us from weddings or baby showers, baptisms, funerals and we create um, sentimental jewelry for them. 
Sure. Also, we do a donation to a nursing foundation that's really close to our hearts called um, MM Trant Foundation. If you want to check that out and make a donation, it's for nurses um, in New England. Um, I'm, D I'm Dasani Martinez, and this is my second year at the Revere Beach Art Festival. Um, I do a lot of paintings about just like how I see the world, and I've been doing a lot of jewelry with upcycled and reclaimed goods and things from sustainable resources. <laughs> Alright, so right here, I made all these from clay myself, um, and it is authentic crystals. Here, I go to a wholesaler in New Hampshire for these crystals, and then I wire wrap them myself. And then um, a lot of these, like earrings and stuff, are actually reclaimed from the what, what are they called? I don't, like the junk jewelry things you can buy at like um, thrift stores. And then I take it all apart and then remake it into something new before I sell it again, just so it doesn't end up in the trash. And then just like my art, just like the way I see like the world with like a little bit more fantasy and color. Hi, this is Mark Martell. This is my art here. First year at the Revere Art Festival. Um, check it out. There's my QR code if you want to pull up the link to my Etsy page. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Kelsey Benedict. Uh, this is my stand. So I've been an artist my whole life and I'm technically trained like college-wise in graphic design. So I like mixing the two. Um, I do a bit of typography, a bit of painting and drawing. Um, and I kind of go, go for like a girly punkish style. Don't know how I would describe my style. I like a lot of different ones. Um, and I'm happy to be here today selling my work. This is one of my first shows in a long time. I used to sell different stuff. I have a new rebrand uh, and it's great to be here. Hey, my name is Bro Brown. Uh, I've been painting since I was four years old, and now that I'm graduating with college, I'm trying to turn my passion into a living. So I hope people enjoy my abstract art, and I hope that I can keep bringing creations to everybody's lives. So my name is Penny Seven, and I'm the seventh girl out of 10 kids, and I'm the youngest of all my brothers and sisters. And um, that's the name of my website, penny7.com. Um, right now, um, I do puzzles, I do um, t-shirts, um, and today I am um, competing in this art festival, and I hope I win. Um, this is my second year um, competing in the art festival, and my second year at the festival itself. Um, and this year we're just doing um, what is a beach um, scene as a on canvas and I'm just enjoying myself and I'm glad it's beautiful and it's it's a beautiful day because yesterday was canceled <laughs>